All right, what's going on guys? It's Juicy P here. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. What you're going to be watching today is a Rampage gameplay. Get a pretty good score with this gameplay here on Firing Range. Anyways, with that being said, one of the things I want to talk to you guys about today is something that kind of gets underneath my skin a little bit, you know? Something that is my pet peeve. What is GCP's pet peeve, you might ask? Well, I mean, there's a lot of things that I dislike, but this is the number one thing that kind of gets me more than anything else, and that's bad attitude. If you have a bad attitude, I automatically dislike you. I just do. It's just something that kind of turns me off automatically. Like, you could be the most beautiful person in the world, right? You could have the most qualifications. You could have the highest education. It doesn't matter. If you have a bad attitude, oh my goodness, does that turn me off big time. Like, I automatically just dislike you that much more. If I already dislike you, if you have a bad attitude, that just, like, is the cherry on the top of the cake. Like, that, that's the final straw. Like, it's the one thing that I just cannot stand. I dislike people who show attitude, who give you, you know, the rolling of the eyes, who kind of make a face at you or something of that nature or say some things that are kind of questionable that make you go, hmm, okay, I got to reconsider what I think about you kind of thing. One of the tips that I could tell a lot of people, especially in my previous job when I used to train people, is when you're going in for an oral interview for whether it's a job or an admission into a school or anything like that where you're in a position where you have to interview for a position anywhere always 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 make sure you put on a smile or at least fake it till you make it and display a good attitude that's the number one tip that i could give you guys is you're gonna be a lot more favorable in the eyes of that person who's giving that interview because a lot of times what they're looking for is good behavior or good attitude somebody that they want on their team you know what i mean like you could have the most qualifications on paper the the best skills in the world like you could be highly educated and beat the whole competition on paper but if you as a person what they're seeing from that person in front of you is not what they're seeing on paper kind of thing, it doesn't translate, like, that doesn't matter. You know what I mean? I would not want somebody with a sour attitude or a bad attitude on my team. I really don't. I don't want to work with people like that. I don't want to speak to people like that. I don't want to hang out with people like that. I really don't. So that's the kind of thing that kind of puts me off more than anything else. That's my pet peeve. If you guys wanted to ever know what GCP's pet peeve was and is, it's that bad attitude anyways let me know your guys' thoughts down below what do you guys think about this commentary what do you guys think about bad attitude do you agree with me do you not do you think it's the most important factor when it comes to you know uh employing someone if you're in that position or having somebody on your team or somebody that you kind of hang out with is that something that you look for if not let me know what your pet peeve is it doesn't have to be about attitude it could be literally about anything anything that you kind of find annoying about people in general <laughs> curious to know what you guys have as your pet peeve anyways with that being said thank you guys so much for tuning in by the way if you like the video hit that like button and if you are new to the channel hit that subscribe button and i'll catch you guys on the next one by the way enjoy the rest of the gameplay this is gcp and i am signing off
Lucky Production.